It's your boy. Okay, we better stop saying that because then it's just gonna be repeating ad infinitum. Exactly. If you guys didn't know, the stream is like 20 seconds behind what's live, so like, really we keep on hearing it in the overhead and it's just funny. Anyways, back to the match. Three, two, All right, we went one, to PS2. Go. I forgot to tell you. I'm upset about it. It's alright. We can see half Tyler's beautiful face. We oh, see all of Linux. When we get that command grab, Tyler not have not have not done any damage yet. Those are down for doing the Ganon combos. There's not many of them to be honest. Yeah. There's a solid three of them. And most of them are off the bro. Lunic gets another grab. Really good at that. Expert grappler, if I had to say so myself. And going for the forward tilt. Oh, and that. In case you didn't know, that forward tilt stays up there. Like even when he's done, when when he's done moving, you can literally run into it. Tyler chooses to roll to regain stage control. Oh, and he spot dodge followed by a jab to push him off stage, and the flame choke to the dash attack. Oh, that forward air from Bowser, like extremely deadly. Really making sense. End of and racking up the damage from Flame Choke. I forgot to put, I forgot to put that. Uh, oh, no. But will he be able to reset this? Let's find out. Oh, you can't be saying that right now. We can't buy it. See, anything could happen. I have faith in my boy. I have faith, but there's different between having faith and being strong. Like, historically, Linux has won this matchup, but Tyler has gotten a lot better. Followed by... That Bowser, he just lives forever. Like, that... That nail will kill every single character in the cast, except for like 20%. Yeah, more like 30%, honestly. Oh, that air dodge was so clutch. I think we have to talk a little bit louder because I'm not sure if we're hearing it in the audio. Um, let's see, do we have chat up here or not? We don't. I wish we did. I can pull it up. All right. Tell me how chat's saying. Chat. Is... Oh, is there no chat? There's chat. Alright, because I want to get some input in case like the audio is good and whatnot. Uh, hey guys, tell us if the audio is garbage, please. Uh, please tell us if the audio is garbage. Uh, yeah. It's fine, I can see it. As yeah. long as it's yellow, I think they're normally good. Alright, that's good. So we'll just talk a little bit louder. Should be fine, hopefully. Yeah, it's late, guys. It's fine. Right now, but we are always here to like have a good show. All right, back to the map where we should have been talking about like two minutes ago. Tyler versus Tyler. 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 Every everything that you expect to be happening is actually happening. Like Bowser's living the 140. Mr. Nichols is dash attacking. Dash attack. Oh, there but that is, because that tech, in case you didn't know, Bowser has like one of the worst tech animations in the game. He's not dead, he's not dead. That's real close though. One more side view will do. Indeed it will. Especially now that he's racked up that extra flame. Bowser, just a character that he needs to get an extra 30. No! Barely not dead, yeah, no. Ganon Bane's a little too bad. He's a two, any, like, if Bowser did, he's on him. Any off, well, not literally, but say. that one, yeah. that would be it. So, and there's game one. Game one to Lunix. We need to take two more to reset this bracket. Let me put, hold on one second, guys. All right, guys, just in case you didn't know, we just put the L right by Lunix name to indicate that he's in losers right now at the moment. All right, I didn't see what stage they picked this up. They're running it back. Running it back. 
every time they seem to run it back. It's always how it is. Yep. It's just such a perfect neutral stage. Yeah, like it's, that's why it's really popular. It's so cool. uh, it has like, platforms, but not too many. It has a lot of open space. Platforms just happen to work out for enough characters for the characters that want platforms. Yeah. Oh, that back here. Oh. So beautiful. How's he gonna fall off the floor there? And he lands it. Really? Oh, the double roll. No one expects it. Oh, the clutch air dodge. I'm waiting for the second that I see three spot dodge. I don't expect me. Soon. Nice to cover uh, jump in with an up air. Yeah, and then he saw that. Ooh, and and that nair down. catches him. Knocks him back. Oh, and he knew he was going to do a get up attack. And he's falling through the flame chokes. Again. This is the Wi Fi cannon. Oh, God, I love Wi Fi. Oh, my God. I don't. That's for sure. Oh, flame choke again. And dash attack. Woo, there's a back that was, that was Tyler wins this twice. It'll be the first time he has beaten Luna indefinitely in bracket. So I'm sure he really wants this. He's two stocks ahead. I'm sure he's really happy about that. He definitely has some room to work with being in winner's side. Normally, ah, oh, such a risk. But yeah, he, he has some room to work with finally being winner's side. Oh, he tried to catch him up, oh, and he double edge grabbed. That will definitely do it for you. Never, never that. That, was just, oh, oh, that was just one of the best at killing, uh, killing off the yeah, He's also one of the best at surviving. I can't tell you that enough, that's for sure. One more good read. All right, see you, okay, uh, Icon. Icon are their place going right here. Yeah, the, going home with the grand prize of $14, which is actually a high for these tournaments. But Mr. Nichols clutches it with the JV2. Bring it to 1-1. One, one. Bring it to 1-1, one, one, Mr. Nichols versus Lunik in the game three. Let's see where exactly they choose to go. Are they just... Both can't go back to Pokey Stadium because they've been, they both won at that stage. Hopefully they actually remember the rule now. They're thinking about pirate ship, like, you know, from Legend of Zelda. Awful, awful stage for Gandalf. But I love the Wind Waker music. It's just really good. Is it a little further from here? Like, you can still talk that loud? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry for the uh, uh, ear torture. Not intentional. I'm Where just. Did they go? I keep on missing it. I'm sorry, guys. I, I could have sworn it would be. Uh, Ice stage. There is no ice stage. Exactly. I thought it was like. <laughs> Maybe. Let's find out. Where are they going? Where are they going? They, they, they did, and they're doing Megalovania at the ice climber stage. I don't know the name of the stage. Uh, I don't remember it. It's Alicia or something. I need to, I need to tell him. Oh. oh, God, I love you. What did he do? I missed it. Did you spike him? Yeah. Holy shizers, man. Killed him like That's the only reason I think this matchup is not I don't know. Ganon, like, Tyler's opinion of Ganon is pretty comfortable. Let's just say that. Look, just because he hates He loves Ganon. He plays Ganon. He just doesn't think that highly of Ganon. I mean, I will agree he has a lot of, you know, right? Oh my goodness. But with that, how can you say that he's just bad? He just stage fight him. If he will this again, we get to all go home early. Not that we... Like I do, but like, you know, <laughs> it's whatever. Like, I'm not going to lie, but... Tyler, playing like a pro out here. Oh my... These heavy boys, they live forever. Let me tell you. Um, not enough. Clearly didn't live that one. He could have. There, there were ways. I think he was just too scared to make it. Oh, speaking about yet. stage fights, okay. but this time it was. There's so much like like off stage play right here. It's getting me anxious. I love it. Was to go for some jank for some up I think I think he was. Oh. I think he was. Oh. I think he was expecting uh, to get up and then uh, shield. Oh my god, he's full saving the jump as well. I can't even talk, I can't even think right now, man. He goes, he cancels. And he just did it, it's 
does! Oh my god, and that is Tyler taking round two. Round three. <laughs> Scooting to the right, like, unless it's like too much. Scoot in. Scoot oh. in this way. There, that's good, that's good. You're on screen. Alright. Now we got Tyler's beautiful face. Like, you do whatever's comfortable. Alright. Oh, right. It was, uh, it was either 3 1 or 3 2. All right, back to the same stage. FD, Ice Famer Mountain, whatever it's called. And Tyler going off really strong at the start. I'm, I'm interested to figure out exactly why Lumix choosing FD here. I feel like there might be a better option. I think it's because he doesn't want to, maybe, I don't know, one possible reason would be if he misses a tech on a platform, he can get like a forward smash, basically. Yeah. But I don't know. He's, 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 like, the reason he was dying wasn't because he was... There really have not been that many smash attacks being thrown out this match. But like, Lunik taking the thing, trying to carry him off to his death, but not to do him. So, yeah. But 90% is not that high count in my opinion, so... with these grab to combos. And these parries to the down smash. Brutal, brutal follow-up. Still very nice. Especially if he keeps them off stage like this. Uh, not enough to like poke them. Oh my god, and I believe Cannon gets like I don't know if he like powers through that dash attack at a certain point, but like maybe he gets like heavy on this ability. I don't know. I know we can claim this stuff. He's gonna follow up with a forward air? Yep. Yeah. Forward aerial. Oh, spot dodges in air. And he's forward throwing. Does that spike? Nope. But it still kills, so good enough. Game five. Going into game five. Yeah. You know, no PS2, no FD. You know, they have to choose a. They have an interesting choice of a few stages. I'm, I'd be surprised if they end up going any of the tri plats. Um, it might be. T I would think maybe Town and City, maybe Smashville. Oh, yeah. That's a correct guess. Going to Smashville as the platform in the huge platform in the center. So good place to recover sometimes. It's a fantastic platform. Especially for like, yeah, if you like do a dash tag and they land on the platform without teching, uh, they can follow up, you can follow up with an up air, so. Just anything. You can just I don't know. Three, two, one, go! And we got the night stage, because it is 9 p.m., my friends. Oh, double grabs ledge, but gets back up because he does not want to be punished. He has always been. Oh, clips him. Down air. Tries to go for the down air. This play is really respecting each other. How did that not spike? <laughs> yeah, just barely. Oh my god, this is really fast pace for these super heavies. Oh my god, his shield looking like a skittle. Oh, uh, not recovering. I'm not happy about that. Uh, Oh my god, that flame choke. Still living. One more to come. Especially with that flame breath. That flame breath is just so under. Oh my god. He gets the roll. Luke did not punch that in time. I think he tried. Oh. But he catches the jump recovery. Tyler living at 180% about. Something oh, both trying to go for the grab, and Tyler like spamming jab, realizing that he just like playing with each other. Oh, spot dodging, beautiful spot dodging. This is gonna definitely do it for him. He's still fresh stomp from 101. It's not 
looking the greatest position right now. It's very nice. Let's come back from way worse than this before. Oh, but the down B counter cancel. Kill right now. He's getting these stringed options, but that down B sends him in the air. Oh, he's gonna fall off the back row. This is really bad to try it. Oh, and he just resets it. This could be the thing he needed to like reset the back uh, set. Oh my god. Oh, tries for the down air. Just getting time. Oh, the flame brush barely goes under it. Oh, forward air. This is a bad place to He doesn't have jump, and he gets the jump back. Oh, neutral get up to roll. Oh. Terrifying spot to go for the You don't want to be under the other. Oh, he goes for the down smash, but it's not the right answer. Clips him with the up B, but flame breath just doesn't work on Ganon. Oh, it makes the tech roll, but is this it? Is this it? Yes, it is it. And it's the reset for bracket. Hold on one second while I update the uh, the uh, ID, the GP. All right. So reset score and let's put it. Finals, whoever wins this set wins the tournament. I'm trying to listen in on uh, on their discussion for stages. They were both really quiet. Start the battle. <sighs> All right. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Hold on guys, one second. I think. We should just update the time because we have a bit of clipping. Oh, yeah. Three, two, one, go! There we go. I'm not sure if they can go to this. Smashville is definitely a star stage, so they definitely need uh, rock, paper, scissors to where they should go. From what I gather, that was the decision making. Oh, that nair barely clips it. Oh, for that four tilt, he's definitely gonna do it in. Doing it with the cheap T-Bag. JK, maybe that was intentional, but that wasn't enough to. Oh my gosh. So much going on in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Oh, I missed that. What happened? Oh, he just jumped. Oh, wow. That, that, that he that used his jump. He got fared at like 30. Oh, that flame choke is not going to reach him. Oh, but that uh, wizard stick got me. Oh, but the floor and smash not coming out fast enough. He just decided to challenge it, but that was not the answer and is going to get punished and cost him the game. option to try to do falling uh, up air onto the up smash. I think he thought that he could just contest it with and maybe uh, get something back from it. But Yeah, but Bowser does have that super armor on like a lot of his smash decks, especially on up smash. I think he has the most amount of super armor on. Better stages. And I think this is one of uh, Ganon's worst stage is because of rock crocketing, but maybe he doesn't need really to have him punish. I think he can just board air. Go! And then. Well, because. If you're. What Bowser But Bowser also doesn't like plat landing on platforms that much. He has a real. Because his down air is how he typically gets out of his disadvantage if he sees that his opponent's can't be confused. But I think they both, like, I think he, um, Looney didn't ban it because of uh, rock rocketing and, like, Tyler chose it because of platforms, but 
I guess we'll have to ask him after the match. Oh, is that gonna do it? That will do it. I think it's a terrifying stage for Ganon because a single side be at like 110 if you hit the middle platform, like it'll kill, guaranteed. Oh. But he can't clip him with the up the anymore. Yeah, I think I think he went for he probably banned the uh, lilac. So like, yeah. But that 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 is the why I guess. I was questioning if using the stage against Bowser because that top platform is really awfully close to the ceiling. It, it's it's literally perfectly positioned for Bowser. Like, there's not much better platform that you can get. Oh my goodness! Got so many so many stuff going on right now. Uh, racking up an extra twenty percent on that flame breath. Goes for the down smash, just doesn't work out. I think that had to have been a miss on Fred. Honestly, I don't think it might. I might have just been him being scared because he thought that a uh, second hit in there would connect. And so whenever it didn't, he just went for down smash. I mean, ooh. Oh, but. He tries to catch the beat. Lunic pulls in just a little too far. Trying to get some back airs. Back airs probably Ganon's best option. Barely misses going through platform. Oh, this is to get the dead oh, I don't think oh he has jumped. Jump. Jump. Nope, he's spiked. There he goes. There's game two to Lunik. This is honestly quite the sad thing to see. It's a very familiar story. Close. He bans stadium. First. Finals and then running it back and then Lunic clutching it out. Let's see if this is the Go same battle. story we've heard before. Oh, it's so close. Uh, game five last set. It's gonna be it's gonna be really sad to see yeah. Mr. Nichols just go uh, 0 3 it does happen. Lunic is really good at this battle of attrition. He just knows how to like basically play for like longer periods of time just to like not wear out and keep this cool in matches like these. Lunic's so so good at conditioning you like games prior. He'll condition you like a full game ahead. He'll be like, well I let you I let you down at me three times. So I was like, if, I, if you're above me, I'm gonna down air you again. Like maybe he tries to condition them throughout other games by letting them get hit when he feels like he can hit them. So he'll sometimes like lose games. Just so that way he knows that he can like, get a kill later. It's a really interesting thing to watch. God. Following up the flame breath. Uh, so far, no one's lost a stock, but Lunin definitely believes this might do it. And that does it. Lunin taking the first stock. Tyler, uh, Mr. Nichols, we need to pull something to bring this back. But Bowser's oh, just such a heavy hitter, like already at 62 damage. 78. He's dead. I'm not. Now, it is only one stock, but. Tyler's gonna need to pull off some real cheese to like get this uh, Lunic down to one stock and he can't take that much damage. Oh, that grab whiffing! Oh, that's the match and we have Lunic winning uh, finals in the reset. Congratulations to Lunic, congratulations to Mitchell Nichols. We had a very lively tournament today. Thank you all to all who are watching and uh, yeah. Uh, to everyone who's watching, uh, we are going to be having uh, the Wright State Raiders uh, YouTube channel that uh, we're going to be uploading most of these matches to. So if you ever want to check those out, um, I don't know the exact tag. We'll probably put it in the description of this Twitch channel. So, And also, we might have a Wright State versus Miami University crew battle. In case any of you guys are interested in having that streamed, we can see what we can possibly do about that. But um, in case you want to support your local Dayton like boys, then just let us know, and we can see what we can do with that. Anyways, congratulations to Lunik and Mr. Nichols for getting first and second. It was an incredible first set, and Lunik clutching it out in the third set. Just making, not really clutching, but making the amazing comeback. And yeah, again, thank you for tuning in and hope you guys all have a wonderful night.